Welcome back heroes to some more Pokemon Violet. Last episode we took down the Poison Team Star member. Today we're going to head to the normal type gym. Before we do that though, I finally found some Sinisties. So they actually do spawn literally just here. I did look before, not a single one spawned. But on the way back here, they, I just saw one. I was like, okay, got it. And then just like they kept spawning and spawning. And yeah, literally just on this hill, literally in front of the Pokemon Center right here. That's where you can get them. So now we've got enough. We're going to go ahead and trade the 10 chips for the item we needed to evolve Charcadet. And we can finally get this bad boy, who's actually going to be part of Ghost, will be good for the normal type gym as well. So that's good. Fancy a trade? Yes, I do. Hello there, child. I'm a collector of uh, curiosities and a great lover of Sinistee. Uh, of a curio with, me, with a dark past, shall we say. It's yours for 10 Sinistee chips. Absolutely. <laughs> that will do nicely. I feel more connected with Sinistee now. Here's the curio I promised you. Careful with it. It's steeped in a potent malice. So we've got the set of malicious armor. Ho oh, ho. It's a peculiar set of armor that can make a certain species of Pokemon evolve. Malicious will lurks within it. So, we'll use this bad boy to evolve our Char Cadet. And I think it's in this bit. Yeah. There it is. Use it on you. Oh, we can get one of the best looking Pokemon ever. I love this so much. This is easily like a top 10 Pokemon. To be fair, both of them are. But I. This is the main reason I got Violet. I was struggling if I want Violet or Scarlet, and just, I like this design so much more. I think it looks incredible. So we've got Serral Edge. An old set of armor steeped in grudges causes Pokemon's evolution. Serral Edge cuts his enemies to pieces without mercy. Oh, so cool, man. I can't believe this is a Pokemon. It just looks insanely good. But Shadow Claw, yes, definitely get that. Go to Clear Smog. And this should hopefully help out with the, uh, the normal type gym. All right, so if we look at the map, we are now going to be heading north. Going to go up here, follow this path. Yeah, we can follow the path. It looks like a um, lot to explore. We're not going to go over here. I'm going to follow this down and we're going to get over here to take on this gym leader. So we don't get to see his face. And then uh, after that, I think we'll head down here to take on the psychic type after. Actually, Serial Ledge would be good for that as well. Ooh, finding them Sinisties actually really, really came in clutch. Because the next two episodes is just going to be taking center stage. Destroying everyone and everything. Alright, Snowy Mountains, Ayo. Got to get to that concert. Ooh, what concert are you going to? I'm trying to think, the last concert I went to... Uh... Oh, I saw... Um... My Chemical Romance, because they're in my hometown. Jasmine's a big lover of them. Me, eh, I like a few of their songs. I kind of just was there, like, don't really know what's going on too much, but some of it's okay. And then before that, I saw... Ooh, who did I see before that? Am I being Yumi at 6? Which is my favorite band. Oh, that night. I was singing so much, my throat was just gone. <laughs> it's like I'd recorded like 50,000 videos in a single day, that's what it felt like. Oh, oh, Swords Dance, yes. Ooh. So you're definitely a physical attacker. We're gonna have to teach you some um, physical fire moves. So we'll get rid of this for now. But Swords Dance and then BAM! Shadow Claw everything for the Psychic Gym. And then hopefully for the normal gym, just Swords Dance and just fire physical attack everything. Are you going to miss the concert? Oof, sucks to be you, dude. Oh, it's evolving! Hey, oh. This thing's got to look good, right? Because it's, uh, it's an ice dragon. Oh, that looks amazing! Arty, arty backs? Oh, I really like this! It attacks with the blade of its frozen dorsal fin by doing a front flip in the air. Oh, so Artibax's strong back and legs allow it to pull off this technique. Oh, this is going to look so good when it finally evolves. Oh, man. My team is coming along nicely. I must say, I think at the moment, this could be my favorite. Oh, there's the, um, like the ice Pokemon that was in the trailer. One of the first trailers. Oh, this is the first evolution. It looks so cute. Uh, as I was saying, I think this is like one of my favorite teams in a Pokemon game I've ever made, like in a playthrough. 
Oh, it's so good. Just loving like all the Pokemon. It's ah, it's, oh, it's amazing. And the fact that we have it, like, and we still. I'd say we're roughly like halfway through the game now, maybe just reaching the halfway point, just gone past it. And the fact that like I have a team that I'm very, very happy with. There's a lot of the Pokemon games that I'm not really happy with the team I get until like I kind of finished everything. Oh, I'm actually loving this game so much. No! Oh, I took it out. It's fine, it's fine. Because there's another one just over here. Uh, I was gonna grab this first. And then what? Oh, it's an Axu there. Oh! Wait. Is that blue? No, I thought I found a shiny one for a second then. Um, anyway, is that Tinker Tuff's final evolution? It's got like a proper hammer. That looks sick. I think that is, right? Uh, right, let me go for a twin beam. If we don't kill it. Yeah, then we're just... Oh no, is that Tinker Tuff? I feel like we don't have that much hair and the hammer looks cool, but... So much going on right now, I'm just... Ah! Right, let me just uh, throw a... We'll throw an Ultra Ball, we've got plenty. Alright, nice. So we've got this. This, this, this is uh, ice, just pure ice, right? I feel like it could be ice water. Just pure ice, okay. Live in frigid regions in pods of five or so individuals. It loves the minerals found in snow and ice. Oh, Like, I like this thing. It's really cute, but I just don't like the evolution. When I first saw it on the trailer, I was like, eh. Not the best. But this. Tinker Tough. Oh, no, it is Tinker Tough. Okay. It just... From out here, it just looked different. I feel like it was the evolution for a second. The hammer just looked bigger. I mean, just like a bigger... Oh, okay. Alright, relax. <laughs> it was just the hammer from, like, being out, walking about. just looked different to me. What's this? Oh, it's the, um, the ghost dog. Oh, I did like this. Oh, I'm kind of curious to see what you'll look like. So many cool dog Pokemon in this game. If you know me, I, I love dogs. Dogs are like, oh, best, best animal. And foxes, I, I like foxes. Foxes are just really cute. All right, now you're asleep. I'm gonna throw an Ultra Ball while you're sleeping. Might get lucky. Come on, come on, come on, be cool. Wait, what's that behind me? I feel like I just saw like a big red and green. Am I seeing things? Oh, that's the yeah, I think that's gotta be the evolution of um the little green thing we have. That's the thing Arvin used against the futuristic Don fan. I'm gonna capture it still just to double check and make sure. There's a load of cool Pokemon in this area here though. But I'm not, I'm not the biggest lover of this, I'll be honest. Let's go, villi let's go villain. But yeah, I, I don't know. I'm trying, I'm trying to get behind it a little bit, but I think it's just the head. If it had like maybe like some life in its eyes, I'd probably like it a little bit more. Maybe I'm gonna try again. If I don't. Catch it with this. I'll have to do a little bit of battling, won't we? Alright, let's attack it then. Sometimes you just get lucky by throwing a ball at it. That's just. That's what I like. Alright, let's go Twin Beam. I wonder what type it is. Oh, it's gonna be Grass something. I could assume Grass Fire. It just keeps going for Zen Headbutt right now. Alright, Ultra Ball, come on. Please get caught. Just want to see your typing. If it's Fire Grass, that's kind of cool. 
Like, it would make a lot of sense. Yeah, grass fire. A spicy pepper Pokemon. So the green head has turned vicious due to the spicy chemicals stimulating its brain. Once it goes on a rampage, there's no stopping it. Ooh. Okay. <laughs> it's just thinking it's like two foot eleven. Yeah, it is the evolution of uh, Capsa Kid. I thought so. All right. Oh, it's a Snom. Hey, yo. Sorry, Snom's gonna take you out. Uh, let's see. Where do we want to go next? Should we see what the raid is? Because last time I got the the cool ice dragon. Well, the good thing about the raids is sometimes you just find Pokemon a little bit early. Get Dratini. That's cool. Nalaxu. I'm going to say it as well. Swords box like winter form. I, I think it looks amazing. Very underrated. In terms of design. I saw that right then. I was just thinking Donkey from Shrek. <laughs> I was thinking like, what's Donkey doing here? <laughs> oh, dude. What an episode though. You're just getting so much. We've got some slack off fur. Uh, I'm going to go up here. So we can find. We've got a Magneton, some Magnemite. Oh, you got the cool looking bug. I'm going to say, I, I quite like this. It looks really cool. Like, if someone doesn't like bug Pokemon in general, just I don't like bugs. The little evolution looks kind of cool. Oh, it's like game's done a very good job for me. Just so many Pokemon I do like. And not many that I don't like. I'm gonna go around this area, just check every like nook and cranny, pick up some items. Yeah, we're not gonna go up there just yet, at least the snowy area. But we'll be coming back this way soon. Probably after the um the psychic gym. We'll probably after the psychic gym go up there towards the ice gym or we'll go towards the team star base. I think it's more to the east of here. The way the crystal dens look as well, it reminds me of um, the dens in Monster Hunter Stories 2. That's a Shellos, I know that Pokemon. Right, can we grab this? Oh, the higher jump we got as well. It's so clutch. Whoa, that's a lot of Pokemon there. A lot of Pyros. Um... I'm going to save the game. I'm going to try and just like kill a lot of these. I feel like I can get some decent experience. If I lead off with you. Oh my god. You got this. No, don't attack the dealing though. Just attack the, the pyro. Oh, don't kill me. I mean, yeah, it's not bad. Get him. Oh, no, okay. Yeah, let's, let's go back. The, the dealing with the, the issue there, the dealing just kept taking it out. That was a lot of Pokemon just chilling. Alright, what else? Just makes me think, like, if we ever get, like, a, a Switch Pro, or, like, a new Switch in the future, like, a, a strong, something with stronger hardware. Okay. <laughs> You could fit so many oh I like rocks. So many more Pokemon on the screen. Can you imagine? Like just Oh, it'd be so good. Like, it's good now. But just think like it can be even more. Right, I'm gonna get, get to the Oh. Oh that the evolution. It's got like a little tombstone on his head. And his skulls. Oh it's just, sorry, it's bones. It looks like um the face reminds me of Skull Greymon. Houndstone. I'm a little bit weak. Can we hit it at least once? It's dead. Oh, that's so cool though. I'm gonna catch this if I can. No guarantees at the moment. 
Now we've got the first form, but just catching it will be nice. Just saves us from like trying to level it up and uh, evolve it and see what it looks like. Right, come on, Ultra Ball, be cool. I just saw the Pyro was behind me. Are they following me? So I think I took at least one of them. And they're like, oh, we're going to get you back for that. Are you going to rest? Oh, yeah, they're, they, oh. They are definitely following me. All right, can we get lucky? Now you're sleeping. Be cool. Be cool. Oh, man, I thought I had it. Right, if I don't catch in this next ball, I'll cut to when I do catch it. Come on, be cool, man. Be cool. Hey, you love to see it. All right, so you are yeah still pure ghost. A lovingly mourned Pokemon was reborn as Houndstone. Doesn't like anyone touching the. Pretty Prince, top of its head. Oh, So cute. I wonder if it's got a third evolution. It becomes Skull Greymon. Oh, wow. Kind of want to jump down there. Where is the Pokemon Center? Is it it's actually down there? It is. So that's a way up to the mountain, I'm guessing. Whee! Alright. Let's get healed up. Boss the Pokemon guy. Nope. I want to talk to you. And get healed up. And we need to be back on the right path to get towards the um, normal type gym. Look at this. When this team's fully evolved, it's. Oh, man. It's going to be amazing. All right, so I think I want to go. Oh, is there a gimme goal there? Back this way. Ooh. All right. Uh. Wait, what is that? Oh, it's a salandit. I get so excited when I see a Pokemon, then it's just something that's just nothing special. Not like saying you're a bad Salander. I do like you. I do. But I was excited about you. Um, man, it makes me feel old now. How was Gen 7 like six years ago? That doesn't... It just doesn't feel right saying. Just, it just To me, it feels like Gen 7 was just literally like last week. And Gen 8 was yesterday. The time just flies by, man. Alright, so now we're back out here. We want to go round. And we go up this way. No, follow the path. That's one thing I like about this like game being open world. You just... Oh, I love answering. You can just get distracted. Just one simple thing. Just change your whole course. It's great. Some ruins over here. Let's go explore them. Oh, that's a lot. Ooh. Hey, Ultra Ball, let's go and jump. Oh, there's a lot. Oh, my Gaslies. A lot of Pokemon just chill on top of a. Uh... Wait. Oh, it's a chest. Nice. So you definitely want to battle and or catch or just defeat the uh, the chest because the chest give you so many coins. Well, they can do. Uh, it's gonna switch out be easier. So I think the most I've seen, I think I got like I got fifty. I want to say because Jasmine's playing right now, she's playing Scarlet. I want to say she got sixty. I want to say nice. 42. Energy ball. Uh, 
I'm not sure if we're more... No, our, our physical attack is much higher, isn't it? You got 50 coins there, it's not bad. I wonder how high up we are as well, because if we are quite high, I can probably just jump off and then glide to where we need to go. Alright. Yeah, that's where we need to go over there, so we'll just... Whee! Glide, and if we see anything, we'll just drop down. But if we want to get back up, we have to go a long way. Do you wonder if that cave takes us to where the Pokemon Center was? The gliding kind of sucks. I just feel like I'm just dropping more than I'm going forward. It'll probably get upgraded and get better. Like the jump did. But that was... A little disappointing, I'll be honest. Oh, you're a vic- I couldn't tell what you was for a second. We've made it to the- Oh, you're a Dene. Keep getting distracted by looking at little things, thinking, what are you, what are you? <laughs> Alright, let's go and take on the normal type gym. That looks kind of nice. Uh, how do I get to the gym, though? Oh, is this it? Yeah. I wonder if I have a battle with Nimona, because I feel like it's been a while. Hey, Voltsy. I saw you go into the gym and came running. Listen, I'm really sorry I couldn't battle you last time we ran into each other. Wait, don't get me wrong. I didn't chase you down just to battle you. Then again, I guess I wouldn't mind a battle or anything if you wanted to. What do you say? Oh, absolutely. Let's go. Yes, battle time. You and me, Voltsy. Wait, hold on. I want to be sure to pick the right Pokemon for where you're at in your journey. So give me a sec to fine tune my team. Then we can battle. In fact, while you're waiting, go ahead and take on the gym. I really hope that means she's going to be like an appropriate level for us and not just, you know, what they think the game should be in the story because that would suck. If we battle her and she's got like late 30s, early 40s, perfect. So what's the gym test? So here at the Medali gym, that means ordering a special secret menu item. Okay, a menu item at the Treasure Eatery, much loved restaurant here in Medali. Order correctly and you pass. Right now, there are three other challengers around town attempting this gym test. Each challenger has been given a different clue that helps them discover the secret dish. You'll be given a clue as well. Please find and battle the other challengers. The loser must tell the winner their clue. Your goal is to gather clues and use them to determine the secret dish, then order it from the waiter at the treasure, treasure eatery. Only the challenger who's able to order correctly will pass the test. Okay, I'm going to write this down. So your clue is to find out how the regular seasons, regulars season their dishes. Okay. So, season dishes. I'll just write that. Alright. Let's go. Kind of feels like, um... Yu-Gi-Oh! Battle City, you know? Going around, just getting their locator cards. <laughs> Alright. Let's find these trainers, shall we? I'm excited for this. Also, do I have any TMs that I can maybe teach Cyril Edge? Because we want to get some physical stuff. Some physical fire moves here. You can't learn Fire Fang. Maybe Fire Punch? Uh, anything worth teaching? I mean, Flame Charge. Kind of Poison Jab. Mm. If we can learn Fire Punch, should we see if we can make a TM for it? Because if I can, that would just make life so much easier. If not, I'm going to have to use Flame Charge, which I don't really want to. Oh, wrong guy. Sorry, dude. Need to go to the TM machine. Uh, Alright, so what can we make? Got Fire Fang, Fire Spin, Flame Charge, Heat Wave, will o -Wisp, Fire Punch. Oh, I can't even learn Fire Punch. Oh, uh, right, so I'm going to have to teach it Flame Charge. 
Oh, that's, uh... I mean, it, it's not the worst, I guess. Once we swords dance a couple of times, it'll be fine. I guess, because we can't really go for Shadow Claw because of the, uh, the joy to be a normal. So where is the, f are you the first challenger? Okay, so the treasure eatery is right here. We also have the secret dish for those of, those of you currently taking the gym test. Do I have to find the people or do I just go in first? Oh, a full restore. That's, uh, that's really nice. Well, this place is massive. It looks really cool, though. Ah, one of the gym test challenges. Hope you're able to figure out our special secret menu item. Okay, we're doing it here. All right. I thought it meant go around the town and find the people, but now tell me, what will you be ordering? I don't know. If I came here on my own, I'd get steak. Steak's always the best. Get a large serving. How do you want it cooked? People are going to hate me. I like my steak well done. Yep. I know people hate that so much. I just, I don't know. When I, I love meat, but when I see the pink on, like, on steak, I just, I don't know. I just, I can't eat it. But, uh, never had cheese on steak, but yeah, it's kind of, kind of cool, but I think that's what we want to do. Oh, thank you very much. Hope you enjoyed your meal. I did. So do I not find the people in here? So I heard. Uh, okay. We need to find the sea, seas, uh, seasoning, don't we? Munch, munch, munch. Was oh, it the gym leader right there? You a regular? Mm, yes, I suppose I do come here often. Must be a gym test challenger. Here's a tip for you. A nice squeeze of lemon. Okay, so let's write that down. So lemon is what we want. Lemon. Okay. Oh. Uh, try talking to the other lady. Nope. Thanks for the meal. Uh, right. Can we go up here and talk to more? So what do you get? I don't think I can get up to the little bit there with all in the middle. No, I want to talk to the person. Can I not talk to you? I can't. So you heard the rumors? I heard rumors that you can change your Pokemon's Terra type here. Oh, sweet. Lobby. I don't think I've ever had grub as good as this. Yeah, so I can't get up there. So we know the one of the answers is lemon. So I've got to find the other other challenges. So they are out here then. Oh, you? Is it other? Oh, it's got to be other academy students. That's what we've got to do. Excuse me, you're taking the gym test, right? Tell me your clue about the secret dish. Uh, never. You tell me, yours. Gum shoes. Okay. So what level are you? Hopefully, we'll be a good level. 34. Yeah, I think we're a good level. This is fine. Give me the flinch. Give me the flinch. Oh, I hate Super Fang. I hate Super Fang so much. I could I could argue that Super Fang's pretty broken as a move. Just half the HP, regardless. It's just so dumb. Hate it. Oh, I'm gonna die, aren't I? Uh let's switch. Uh Let's go Cereal Edge. Gotta gotta try it out, man. Bring this bad boy out. Oh look at it. One of the best looking Pokemon. Easily, easily a top ten Pokemon. So cool. This is peak Pokemon design right now. Oh come on, we can't be missing. Look at it. It looks so cool. Any other version as well? 
the one with Scarlet also looks cool, but I, just, I think this one looks so much better. Avoiding the attack, good. That's what you like. Love avoiding the attacks, it's so, so good. There we go. Actually, I want to check my ability. Should the ability to have a Pokemon as well. Uh, Greedent. I'm going to stay in. And just keep flame charging. Not, not the best damage, but hey, it'll do. My bite is going to hurt. We should switch. Uh, I was going to Tinker Tough. It's actually insane to me as well how, like, kind of balanced my team is. So, like, going for all the types, we have Grass Dark, Fire Ghost, Normal Psychic, Steel Fairy, Rock, Ice Dragon, like, look at that, man. That is such a good type for everything. I got, like, all grounds covered. The Rock Smasher. Oh, does, like, no damage. But at least your defense gets lowered. I think a play rough next should take you out. Oh, you got a big counter. Okay. Relax. Oh, I didn't finish you off. Body slam. Do not paralyze. Do not paralyze. Do not paralyze. Oh, I paralyzed. It's fine, I'll get healed up after this. Not to worry. Alright, what's your clue? So I mean, do I have to get the clues then go into the um into the restaurant and talk to people again? Alright, so what's the clue? Oh it's evolving! Everything's evolving this episode. Nice. That looks insane. Look at the hammer. Got Tinker Ton. Oh my god, I love this. Hammer tops 220 pounds, yet it gets swung around easily by Tinker Tong as it steals whatever it pleases and carries its plunder back home. This is such an awesome Pokemon, man. Wow. It's got its own move as well. Let's get rid of Metal Claw for it. Oh my god, this... These Pokemon just get better and better. Alright, what's your clue? So my clue is to look for something that's the odd one out at the... One of the ice cream stands. Okay. Uh, odd one out. Ice cream stand. You mean out here? Uh, ice cream, ice cream. Are you the one? I... Oh, greetings from Kanto. Kento! Oh, this is making me so hungry, man. I would love a crepe. But I can't eat like bad right now. I'm trying for a marathon, man. It's in five months. Ugh. Oh, Gotta be good. But it's making me want a crepe so bad. There's a really nice uh, dessert place near where I live. Like, they do, oh. Like, Oreo crumble drizzled in white chocolate, like waffles. And, oh, they're so, so good. So good, but I, I can't. I can't. Make me want one right now. Man, this game just has too much good food going for it. Alright, so what am I doing? Any more gym trainers about? Hmm. Can I say I don't like this gym test? Ours is kind of cool. Oh, what is the... Oh, it's LeChonk's Evolution. It's like a little place to do theatre, you know? And they're just looking at me like, what are you doing down there? Where are the gym trip? 
I say gym trainer, it's like the, the student sat. Uh, wait. You're from Spice? Oh, I was just saying spicy dishes a little bit. Oh, you're a student! Aha! Okay. Taking the gym test, aren't you? I can tell. Gary, to spill the beans about your clue. This guy's got a nice little, like, uh, beard coming along. Got Dunsparce. I'm still holding out hope this game has a Dunsparce evolution. I've seen so many Dunsparces and other Gen 2 Pokemon in this game's had uh, some love. Mm. I'm gonna go Sulk here. But I, I feel like we're finally at a point now in the game where like we are a, we're a good level. We're not over leveled. I mean some Pokemon are slightly over leveled, but yeah, for the most part we're good. Let's go rock throw. Think about our team is the next Pokemon to evolve is surely gonna be Knuckle Stack. Ouch. Can we take out the Dunsparce? Surely one more rock throw will do the trick. Don't miss. Ooh. Kind of worried there for a second. You got this. Way level 38. Let's go. Oh, Stealth Rock, yes. Uh, I'm gonna get rid of Iron Defense, because I can't use that because of the um, Salt Vest. Alright, what's next, buddy? So, what's your clue? No way, you're evolving! Everything's evolving this episode! Oh, please look good. Please look good. Oh, I actually kind of love this. Gar Gar Garganackle? Oh, he's so cool! <laughs> Many Pokemon gather around Garganackle, hoping to lick it. <laughs> lick it its minimal, minimal rich salt. I'm pretty sure, like, let me Google this. I'm pretty sure it looks like a Minecraft Golem. Minecraft Golem. Like, I mean, kind of, yeah. Oh my god. Uh, hammer arm? Yeah, sure, why not? I'll, I'll just... Our team is just looking... I can't believe we had four evolutions this episode. Alright, what's your uh, what's your clue? So, listen really closely. The blue bird Pokemon. Still puzzling over the what it said. All that thinking kept me from focusing on the battle. So, blue bird. Isn't the blue bird over here? Uh, Talkabilly. No think. Me, me oh, medium. Okay. So that the size has got to be medium. Didn't this know of three trainers to find? So the other clue was the odd one out of the ice cream stand. I don't know. Alright, let me find the third trainer. And then uh We'll go from there. This question is... Oh, are you the third trainer? Yes. Okay. So the answer we have so far is lemon medium. And if I can't find out what the odd one is at the ice cream stand, then we'll just have to uh, just guess. Trial and error. Let's go rock throw. Look at this big boy. This is so cool. Might lose this fight, but... I don't care, I'm happy. We can just live this one attack. Yes! One more rock throw, should finish it off. No! <laughs> yeah, I had to miss. 
Oh, that's so unlucky. That's so very unlucky. But we'll go, uh... Tinkerton then. Oh, this is just... I can't say I've got a big grin on my face. I'm loving this. Look at the hammer, man. Gotta go for the animation, see what this looks like. <laughs> Flatten that Elsa ring. <laughs> oh, wow. It's been an absolute banger episode. Alright, so what is your clue? Uh, the clue I was given is a dark spot surrounded by stairs. Do not remember seeing any particular dark spots in town? A dark spot surrounded by stairs. This? Oh! Fi oh, Fire Blast, okay. Fire Blast. So we just need... The last clue is over here. Pokemon out. Pokemon love it. Come try a bite. I should, okay, I'm going to get healed up. And I want to go look at the answers again just to see what like sort of group we're missing. Then we can find the answer. If that makes sense. Just one more evolution and my team could legit be finished. Unless I find something really awesome I've got to add to the team, but I am, I am loving this team. Alright, let's see if we can do this. So, ooh, secret menu item. So this is the one we don't know. So we know we want medium serving. And we want it fire blast style. And then we want lemon. Wait, was that it? Oh, this is the one. Medium rice balls, extra crispy with lemon. Come on, got that right first try. I was just just wanted to see what the um the first bit was, so we we knew. Congratulations, you've passed the test. Now have the right to challenge the gym leader. Please come speak to me again when you're ready to battle. Ooh, okay. So just to recap, it's rice balls, then medium, fire blast, lemon. That is what you need. All right, let's talk to you. Do you want to face the exceptional every man himself, Jimmy to Larry? Yes. In that case, please head on to the battle court. Larry, you're up. That is the guy with the briefcase there, right? He reminds me of Nanu. Hello. <laughs> I'm Larry. I'm assigned to work as the gym leader of the Melodali, Me Medali gym. Good job on making your way through the gym test. And well, maybe try the other dishes on the menu too sometime. Everything good everything's good here. I'd love to, man. Anyway, my boss will dock my pay if I spend too much time chit-chatting. Let's get this over with. Who's your boss? <laughs> Owner of the restaurant, maybe? Thank you for doing business with us today. I, Larry, will be at your service. Dude does Seems like he does not want to be a gym leader. Larry. I can't- I, I still forget that Pokemon exists sometimes. I just ate, so let's not go too hard. Hell no! I got four new evolutions today! I'm going super hard to try all these Pokemon out. Alright, I'm going Stealth Rock first. Oh wait, oh dude. I thought it was just I can't use status moves. I thought I could still use Stealth Rock. With uh, Assault Vest. Oh, that's annoying. We can't hit me because of Purifying Salt. 
So I have to remove the uh, assault vest after this. And wow, that damage. Let's go. Alright, what next? Wait. The Dunsparce? So Dunsparce has got an evolution. What? Is that it? It just got like an extra... Oh, that's... That's so terrible. I've seen so many like fakey Dunsparce Mega Evolutions or Evolutions in like fan games and it is so much better than that is. They did Dunsparce dirty, man. They did it so dirty. Are you, are you kidding me? That's it? That's actually a little disappointing. The Dunsparce, that's so bad. Game Freak, you did Dunsparce dirty. You did it so dirty. And the, the fake, maybe some, like, I thought it could have an evolution because matter we've seen. And with the Gen 2 love. We get that. Oh, that. Oh, that's just. I'm sorry. I'm disappointed by that. It's still better than getting cornered by my boss. <laughs> but at least, like, the Gen 9 Pokemon are awesome. You know? I mean, that is technically Gen 9, but you know what I mean. Like, the new Pokemon. Not, like, evolutions of other stuff. Let's go Rock Throw. You're pretty good. Might end up losing this. Is that it? Yep. Come on, Larry. Step it up a notch. We've got hungry customers waiting. Give him something to cheer for, you hear? Oh, people coming in. Show us what you got. Oh, look at that. Everyone's cheering for Larry. Let's go, boy. Well, you heard the good folks. I suppose I can put on a bit more of a show. Okay, so it's a normal type star raptor. I think it's time to show you that real life isn't all just being true to yourself. I think it's time to show you that my my giant Minecraft golem's gonna destroy this whole building. Oh, there's like nothing, but I guess we can go hammer on now. I mean, this could be a lot worse. I don't think we live the next attack, but if we do, clutch. Oh, unlucky. It's fine, it's fine. I do love the music. Uh... Yeah, I want to go our new, like, uh, Dragon Eyes Pokemon. Oh, the backs. It's so cute. Let's go Dragon Claw. Doing damage though. Oh, we didn't finish it off. Oh no. Damn, we're just spamming that move, ain't he? Okay, it's fine, it's fine. Uh, you wanna spam that move? Try hit me with this. Alright, Flame Charge! Oh, Aerial Ace, okay. Change it up a little bit. A critical hit, not that it matters, but still good. Nice. You certainly threw me for a loop. Yeah, I did. You're rather strong, aren't you? Enough to bring out my poker face, even. I lost, so that means I have to give you a gym badge. But, oh. That battle made me a bit hungry. 
Can you join me for a meal? Didn't you, you didn't you just say you just ate? That is a lot of rice balls though. Have uh, five gym badges in hand, it makes it easy to catch Pokemon to level 45. Oh, they're actually listening to you too. This is for you. Though hopefully a child like you has no need to put on its uh, namesake. Thank you very much. So the dishes here, they've all got flavour. Good flavour, I mean. Oh, don't worry about the bill. I do earn a salary after all. <laughs> now, I'd uh, better get back to work, if you'll excuse me. So I wonder what you work as. This seems like your typical 9 to 5 businessman. Oh! Hey oh. Never Jimmy did defeated. Well done. Rika informed me that there was an unusual trainer worth keeping an eye on. Seems she meant you. I'd guess as much. I had the pleasure of observing your last match. I was impressed by the fantastic skill you showed. If you manage to keep your momentum and achieve champion rank, I'll be very interested in inviting you to the Pokemon League and... Hey, Voltsy! Got my team all picked out. And I saw you battling the gym leader. You just kept getting better. Uh, how good to see you again, Champion Nimona. It's certainly been a while. Whoa, wait, La Primera? Is it Prim Primera? Right? With Voltsy? Uh, why do you call it that? Wait, did I forget, forget to give you the full explanation? Everyone calls Mosquita La Prima? Prima? Prima. Prima. I don't know how you want to say that, but... Because she's just that. She's the real number one. Even higher than us regular champions. She's the top champion. Oh, top dog! I do indeed hold that claim. Alongside my role as chairwoman of the Pokemon League, that is. I thought you were too busy to spend your time checking in on gyms. I'm not here to inspect the gym. I've come to scout some rather promising young talent. Whoa! Look away for one second, you're famous, Voltsy? But hey, I found Voltsy first. You may be La Prima, but you can't go stealing him from me. I suppose I'll have to get in line. That's right, come on, Voltsy. Time for our battle. Quick, let's go! The battlefield's calling. One moment, please. Huh? What is it? I'd very much like to observe this match. That's alright. Ooh, totally fine by me. Sounds fun, right, Voltsy? Yeah, boy. Let's go. Thank you kindly. I'm already excited to see you two face off. Let's be on our way, then. Sounds good. Straight into the battle. Thought I might have like a little rest first, but uh, battle after battle after battle. This has been like an action packed long episode, so hopefully you guys enjoy. Do you remember how it all works, right? Once you get badges from all the gyms, you get a throw down against the strongest Pokemon trainers around. Yes, you must face the Pokemon League. It's located to the northwest of Mesa Goza. The Pokemon League is where trainers are reborn as champions. The greatest honor that they might dream of. Collect collecting eight gym badges sets you up to take the champion assessment. If you can face the challenge of the final examiner and win, you become a champion. Just imagine how that moment would feel. Try getting into that champion mindset. Now, set your sights on reaching that big important stage and let's battle- Oh, excuse me one moment. I believe Voltsy's Pokemon may still be a little fatigued. Thank you! <laughs> Sorry, I got a little caught up uh, in my uh, battle hunger. Well, you should sure be in great shape now, thanks to La Primera. Okay, Voltsy, time to put on our game face. Time to put our game faces back on. Let's have another fruitful battle. Sounds good. All right, let's do this. Got a Lycan Rock. Okay. Day form. Oh, I've got it. I didn't get a chance to take a salt vest off, did I? No, La Prima's watching, but no need to get worked up. Just stay cool. Uh, all right. I'll switch into Meow Scarada. Actually, what level are you? Didn't see a level. You can bite. That's fine. 36, okay, yeah, we're, we're a good level right now. Nice. So far, so good. Oof, that was a good one. Your move really had some zing to it. Eh, I try. Whoa, critical hit, right when it counts? 
luck's on your side for sure. I don't think so. I think Flower Trick always crits, doesn't it? So, um, yeah. <laughs> Wait, Tinker Tong level 39. What's that? Fake out. Absolutely. I'm going to get rid of Rock Smash. Because Rock Smash doesn't really do too much. I mean, the defense drop is nice, but it's not worth it. For that, we can go to other backs and go for an Ice Fang. We've got your number, Nimona. We're going to destroy ya. you. You're going to see my, like, all my evolved Pokemon right now, have you? They're all so good. All right, Ice Fang. Whee! Oh, I wonder if we'll see Quaxley's final evolution in this battle. Oh, hopefully. Uh, Pormo, uh, Electric Fighting. Let's go for this, and we'll go for Twin Beam. Then all we gotta do is see Foy Coco's final evolution, and then I can finally decide which one is the best. I mean, I love Sprig. I love all his evolutions. So for me at the moment, Grass is winning. Which is odd because I mean I think Gen 7 and Gen 3, like I all all three starters are amazing. Can't decide, but usually I'm I go towards the fire type. In case you're wondering, for me, Gen 1 fire, Gen 2 fire, Gen 3, I could pick any three of them, I love them all. Gen 4 fire, sometimes grass. Gen 5, I don't really care to be honest too much about any of them. Gen 6, Water, Gen 7, all three of them, Gen 8, Fire, and now Gen 9, Grass. Alright, getting right, I'm getting back into a corner. Yeah, you are. Wait, is this it? Ooh! I actually quite like that. It's a dancer! I legit thought when I first saw it, it was gonna be like a military looking duck, like a soldier sort of thing. I thought it'd be like water fighting. Oh, this is so cool. I like it. Not my favorite though, but time to terrestrialize. Watch. Gonna make La Primera's eyes light up. Oh, she's going for Thunderbolt. She's gonna be water type, aren't you? Does look really cool. Okay, I'm pulling out all the stops. Get ready, I wanna see you stand up to this. Oh, Aqua Step's got to be a signature move. Oh, that's cool. And it raises your speed, okay. Not the best damage, but I'm going to see if I can get a Thunderbolt off. Well, if we can live this. Nope, it's fine, it's fine. So I'm going to terrestrialize, which I don't really do too much in this game. I feel like I haven't done too much at the moment. I think it's just because like you want to use that important battle. So I've been using it for the Titan battles, using it for just like some gym. I think use last gym because me too, but oh, that's all good. Let's get it. Flower Trick should finish it off easy. Little Air Slash. That's gonna hurt. Don't flinch. Woo! Nice. Is that your last Pokemon? I feel like it's gotta be. People are going to start uh, paying more and more attention to you. I just know it. Because I'm the best. An amazing display of talent. Even against one as skilled as champion Nimona. That was a splendid match. I enjoyed watching very much. Now even La Prima thinks you're one to watch. you got so much potential. The way you're going? Better watch my back. You know, since the first time we met, I've been, 
I've been weirdly sure of one thing. You're going to become a champion, no doubt about it, Voltsy. The rest of these gyms, you can take them, 100%, no problem. I agree. In fact, you should take this. Consider it an investment in your future. Oh, Terror Blast. If the user has terrestrialized its energy of its terror type, it unleashes the energy of its terror type. This move inflicts damage using the attack or special attack stat, whichever is higher for the user. Ooh. Okay. Pokemon uses that move while terrestrialized. The move's type will change to the terror type of the Pokemon. That's really cool. One day, Volti, you and me are going to have the greatest battle of all. I know it. Going to go train up even more than I already have been. She shows you su sh such support and friendship. Or perhaps. Perhaps she hopes you truly might rival her. No. I think it's no mere hope. She seems to have complete faith that you'll catch up to her. At any rate, let me to return you to the gym where I found you. I mean, thanks, but I'm more than capable of making my own way around. <laughs> oh man, but I think that's everything, yeah. So, next up, I guess we head to the Psychic Gym. I think that's probably the next best area to go to. We've got one more Titan to take down. One more, no, two more. Uh, team star bosses so you yeah, got tying up here I think we've got to go down for hit here next right that's got to be it so we can get to her. if we can't get to her then we'll go do something else but whew, long episode today but thank you guys for watching I'll catch you guys next time thank you so much for watching have a great day peace